Hello, this is Susan Sun on the Maker with sunisthefuture.net. I'm here still at Adelaide, uh, Australia, and at this moment I am with the Malaysia team, the Team Malaysia, and uh, tell us here is a member of the uh, Team Malaysia. Tell yeah. us a little bit about your team and yourself. Okay, basically uh, our solar car is the name of our solar car is Solar Ranger. So we have been this participating in this uh, race for I think this is our second time. Solar for, Ranger is that uh, inspired yeah. by the Solar Ranger on yeah, the television? Yeah, Ranger I think because due to the Australian, you know, a lot of Australian they have a Ranger right, uh, oh. so we use that one. So basically, this is our second uh, attempt, and with a modification, uh, a, a bit modification from the previous one. Uh -huh. So, uh, so uh, for our solar car, basically we have this time we use uh, five watt. Uh, every each piece of the solar cell is about five watt, so the whole is eight hundred watt. Oh, eight hundred watt. Yeah. Level. Okay. Mm. So we have completed so far for this uh, for this total race uh, around two hundred fifty kilometers, mm -hmm. and. We expect that maybe for the incoming event we can increase more performance by changing our solar cells. Yeah. And what have you learned from this uh, particular race? Uh, basically, what I can see is that because this is our my first time, uh, the, this is the the solar car is the second time, but my experience is this first time. So basically, what I can see is that there is uh, is not. Uh, for this event, this is not about the solar car itself. It's about how to build up the capacity of the manpower. Yes. Because for you to to have this uh, very nice car, you you need a lot of commitment in from your team members. And for the time being, our our team members con, uh, consist of 25 person, and it's a very huge. I mean, a lot yes. of manpower. Of so nah, so. Uh, we have to plan, schedule our time properly so that um, we can achieve our target within the before the race come. Yeah. Yes, that's what we're all looking forward to, and that's what we're working this is, for. Uh, this, in fact, this uh, this is not a one-man show. This is a team members. Uh, Sure. Yes, okay. we can see. That's what we're emphasizing yeah, uh, yeah. through the whole uh -huh. race uh -huh. and the uh, um, also uh -huh. even in the beginning of the open ceremony we hear yeah. the organizer uh -huh. consistently mentioning yeah. that. But it's, it's really true that it's good to have a solar technology uh -huh. for our cars for futures. But uh, maybe we have to intensify the research on the solar cell because... Uh, and the battery system. Yeah, the battery also. system, right, correct, for the storage. Uh, because so far, I think uh, most of the solar producers, for especially for the cars, uh, the efficiency is around 20 to 40 percent efficiency for you to have a a good performance car. Uh, so maybe it can be increased into above than 40 percent efficiency. It's just so a matter depends, of time. Yeah, matter of time, matter mm -hmm. of research and funding for research. So. <laughs> well, thank you very much, yes. and uh, thank you very much. With uh, this is the uh, the Solar uh, Ranger, Ranger, right, yeah. from Malaysia team, yeah. and signing off, Susan Sun Nanamaker at sunisthefuture.net. Thank okay. you very much.